after playing Skyrim for a long time, beating all the quest lines, finding every secret, and exploring every cave. Have you ever gotten tired of Skyrim's basic weapons? Well, I have, and instead of adding the usual Skyrim weapon mods and whatnot, I added a mod that makes everything a weapon. And no, I'm not just talking about this little knife thing or these weird scissors. I'm talking about everything from a tankard, a jug, and a broom, all the way to a freaking chair, like it's some kind of WWE match. This mod is called Weaponized Junk on Nexus and basically makes almost all miscellaneous items into a weapon. For example, when I pick up a tankard, it turns into a weapon. If I click C on a chair, candle or even an urn, I pick it up as a weapon. Now all these weapons deal more damage on the first hit and some of them even break after a few hits, meaning I have to find new ones regularly. So by cracking skulls with a chair, stabbing people with a jug, and beating dragons with an urn, I have to complete Skyrim's entire main quest and kill Alduin the World Eater. If you managed to enjoy the video, remember to subscribe and leave a like to make my day. Now with all that said, enjoy my attempt to answer the question, can you beat Skyrim? with junk as weapons. The challenge starts in Helgen, where we create a big strong handsome orc called Junk Collector and then escape Helgen by beating people with a tankard. And when we eventually make it to Riverwood, we find a chair and find out we are not nearly old enough to handle a chair. I a fine day to you, friend. May you die. Let's go. Wait, my chair? What? What do you mean? Did they put the chair down? Wait, what? I oh it is it's right there. <laughs> it's a little chair. Here for work? No, I'm trying to what sit on my chair, dude. I dude. What if I do like this? <laughs> I don't know, this is so, this is so funny. I mean, can I play some I'm at, I'm like a dude? Probably can't, right? Wait, no, give me the chair. It's clearly right there. You mean? Thank you. What if I climb like a roof? Wait, what if I... Alright, I'm gonna place this chair in the main. You look worse than I feel. Dude, I don't give a shit. I'm gonna put a chair in you. All right. Need something? <laughs> oh, oh, you're right down there, man. You want? <laughs> Dude, brother, you're are you all right? Fuzzy. What's wrong with you? Dude, what do you mean I'm fuzzy? Dude, I'm. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna leave him now. He seems a little bit weird. After stealing people's furniture in White Run. We talk with the Jarl about the dragon attack and about the new chair standing in the middle of the hall. Next we get instructed to go clean up the local nursery home, aka Bleak Falls Barrow, where we murder all the bandits trying to stop us from getting in. Then we kill even more bandits, and then crushed the nursery home's guard dog. Let's see about the damage. No, 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 no! Wait, 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 wait! But that's stupid. Wait, 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 wait! <laughs> Just dumb. We then murder a man and steal his claw, and oh wait, there they are, the seniors. Wait, n now it seems we're killing them. I mean, uh, that must be illegal or something at least.
But now we approach the Grand Master of the Seniors. Stop zombies. Alright, we can even use that. <laughs> Look at the damage. After delivering the dragonstone I got from the Drog Overlord to the town wizard, Faringar, I hear something about a dragon, and like 50 minutes after almost being executed and killed by a dragon, I rush out to defeat my first dragon. Don't even doubt me for a second. This dragon is going to die when it lands. Give it a second, it's gonna land. I'm gonna. Beat the shit out of him with this, with this uh, little urn over here. Big urn, actually. Pot, I don't know what to call it. What a pussy, come on. I don't even feel a thing. Really think I felt that? You must be crazy, I don't even feel that either. You do better than that. He's already dead. Come on, let me do something at least. There we are! Go, 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 go! Boom! Oh, oh my god, I got him. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit! We then discover we are the Dragonborn and suck the soul out of a dragon and then use our new shout to scare all the guards. We then get yelled at by the Greybeards and decide to head up the mountain to their old and dusty castle. Alright, I can't see any sh shit. What, what, what am I doing? I don't even know where I'm going. I feel like there's usually a hole somewhere. Oh, wait! Alright. I've been hunting and fishing. Fuck you, man. Give me this horse. I'll let you live. Wait. You there we are. Thank you. I can't see where I'm going. I can't actually see anything anymore. I might just be going off the mountain right now. I don't, uh, and I wouldn't know. All right, troll. Give me a break. Somehow this stolen horse also helping me. No idea why. It shouldn't actually help it help me. I can also hit it with a, like a jug. First time I saw it. Oh, uh, oh, yeah, uh, okay. I guess it's going now. Inside. We find a urn. Oh, you see that? Sure. <laughs> it's 124. Oh, well, we actually have this still. I don't know why it does 14 damage now. But we have this. It's it's pretty crazy. This thing, 125 damage. That's insane. And discover it can be used as a hot tub. But learning a word of power. <laughs> All right. We're gonna give him the gift soon. <laughs> Actually, it's a hot tub. I'm gonna be one of those hot tub Twitch streamers now. In Skyrim. We then learn more of that powerful shout and get the ability to be the flash for a solid half a second and then get instructed to go acquire their horn that they somehow lost in a tomb with dead people. While trying to get to the tomb, we get jumped by some hooded shady people and just absolutely fold them. Aren't they like Nothing mad? Aren't they like gonna shoot me with fireballs soon? Boom! <laughs> what a what a dumbass! When I post my uh, my jug, I think so. Then we get to the tomb, and inside we start once again to crush people's skulls. Are you ready for this? Are you sure you're ready? Are you sure? Are you sure? Are you also sure? Whoa! It's all <laughs> oh my god, it's right here! I already found one. Give me that. Give me that shit. How good is this urn? Not as good. A ceramic urn. It's oh it actually is the same. I'm just I don't know what I'm talking about. Time to beat the shit out of this guy. Oh! 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 Wait, what? 
and somehow stab a drug with a jug. It's gonna do this like this. Stab in the head with a with a jug. This is sneaky bone actually. Hello. Boom. Oh, it broke. Alright, let's get this thing then. I got Oh we got a two-handed candle. How much damage does this do? Already this kinda I don't know that that, that, that be great, alright. Oh my leg. His kneecaps and his neck. Boom! The fuck out of here. What's wrong with you? Are you having a stroke up there? Alright. Okay, now we're gonna get down. Of course you do. Oh! We then find out that the horn is gone. And all that's left is a note instructing to go to Riverwood and ask for the attic room. But then we also found out something cooler. That we can combine junk into cool ass weapons. Oh, what? Armorized bucket? This armor? What? That's really cool though. What's the best one in here? Damage? Whoa! We have a nice clothes, iron, warhammer. So it's just four leather strips, weaponized broom, five weaponized clothes, iron. That's pretty cool. What? Why would I want this? Oh, here we are. Weaponized tank on maze. That's pretty cool. Whoa! What is all this stuff? Where did you come from? What? All right, and then we test out the hot tub in the river But apparently it's too small and quite ugly and uh, and now we are divorcing the urn the new top No, the new top is disgusting. I'm gonna leave the new top I'm gonna divorce you. All right And you're not gonna I'm gonna file for divorce it's hot tub <laughs> and there's nothing you can do about it. All right then we talk with Delphine about a new dragon attack and make her stuck by placing a chair on the ground. Right. Man, what if I place a chair right here? <laughs> what, a, what a stupid ass. What are you gonna do now, huh? <laughs> you are, you're, such, you're such a dumbass, you know that, Delphine? Love the music in the background. Alright. What the fuck is she doing in here? We then proceed to slaughter the dragon with a barrel and a water jug. What? Alright. <laughs> this barrel is crazy. Holy shit. Oh my, oh my god. Oh, there is a bit now. <coughs> All right. More no near dragon. You're scared of a little log, are you? Let's use this cool power I got. I should reach. I think that's pretty cool. I should have done that with the barrel, right? Oh, I get him. <laughs> oh. All right. Get him! Get him! There we are! There we are! Get him with the jug! Get him with the jug! Hit him! Hit him with the jug! Oh! Stabbing the air with the jug! God damn! Oh! Oh! Alright. We then got some kind of pot and used it as a helmet for the rest of the entire playthrough for some reason and was ordered to go infiltrate the Thalmor embassy for some secret information. So we went to a dude named Melbourne and gave him everything we had and went our way to the Thalmor embassy. Immediately when arriving, 
I got some man to make a distraction, and I snuck out the back door and retrieved my stuff, and then began searching the place for information. No, there's no talking, there's beating of, of guards. Oh my god, they're beating me up. It's taking it like, like fucking something, I don't know. Give me the chair. This is not what it. It's not a fucking chair. Give me this. Now I'm gonna beat them. Boom! And take that. Oh, it's gone. Oh, give me another chair. Are you ready for this? Oh, boom! Bow! Boom! Another one. Boom! Another one. Boom! Another one. Oh, oh, oh. Last chair. Give me this shit. Bow! Boom! Fuck! I got him. There we are. Run it! Run it! Oh! 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 Broke the chair on his head somehow. Beautiful. Fuck! I got him. I almost got him. Oh, there we are. Fuck you. Do you think you're something, huh? Do you think you're something, huh? Fuck you, man. And I'm out. Oh no, there's people in here too. Red. Whoa! What is that entrance? There's no way to welcome a man. What? What are you doing here? Little regular dude. Hey, 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 hey. Alright. As I said earlier, this is not how we do around these corners. Get the fuck out of here! What is what is these guys' problem? Do you have no manners? Give me something, chair. Yeah. No! 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 Chill! Chill the fuck out! Take that. Chair! 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 This? No. All right. We have a chair. We have a chair. There we are. Break the chair on his head. And go like this! <gasps> Boom! That's how we do it around here. After we learned about Esperon inside the Thelma Embassy, we escaped and went back to quickly talk to Delphine and then went looking for Esperon in the series of Riften. Did we even have to ask him? Can I just what was that? wait? Can can I just like go through here without asking the dude? Shouldn't I be able to do that? Go away. That's better. Now we can talk. What? So Delphine keeps us to fight. Dude. I thought you had realized it's hard. Help me. I tried to tell him years ago. Goodbye then. Don't run. Stay for dinner. No. So, Piece of shit. I thought she'd have read what? Then we must go quickly now. Too easy. Are you sure about that? Good thing so, man. Oh, exploded that dude. Okay, okay, okay. All right, all right, all right. I see you. Can't even take the ammo. It would be so cool though. Come on, Esper. Okay, I can go back to Riften now. River would know, right? Apparently not. Why is this? Why is the enemies? Who? Unlike every other challenge, this quest was very quickly done, and I was very happy about that. When Esper was back, he talked to Delphine in a very weird manner. It's been She's already too mad long, at him. Old friend. <laughs> He's well, just walking yeah. away. <laughs> you <made it> <laughs> Where are you going? What are you running for? What? And then he told us to go to a big wall to learn shit in a cave or something. Now, this wall told Esperin about a shout capable of defeating Alduin. So first, we had to speak with a dragon up on a mountain telling us about an Elder Scroll containing the shout. And getting the Elder Scroll was relatively simple. 
Firstly, we rob an old man in his home, find a dwarven ruin and kill everything there. Then we make our way into Blackreach and further into a tower and inside that tower is a puzzle. When completed, yields the Elder Scroll. With the Elder Scroll in our possession, we read it and engraved our eyes with weird symbols and started broadcasting a crazy fight with dragons inside our eyes. And then our eyes somehow teach us the shout and before we know it, Elduin approaches in the sky. Got him. We use this. This one. Ready for this? Land here. I'm gonna. I'm gonna murder the shit out of you. And do power. Do two power attacks. That does. This this thing does. 181 power attack will do probably like 250 double damage for it. For the the the, the thing. You know. Probably 500. That's gonna be a thousand damage in all. Come here, dude. Are you ready for this? This, and then get him. Boom! And another one. Oh, it's broken. No mind. Get him down. Okay, okay, okay. Alright, alright, alright. So we gotta hit both of them to get the third extra stay on the ground so he will hit what? I guess not. It's just flying now. You're right about that, Pathernex. Getting him. Oh, I'm dying also. Whoa, 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 whoa. Chill out. Now they're gonna fight each other so I can get sneaky hits on him. Very nice. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Oh, oh. It's almost dead, actually. Alright, we should level up here. Beautiful. Now we get some power attacks on him. Almost dead. Oh, well, here we are. Nice. Fuck you, man. When Elduin got defeated, he chose just not to die and just flew away uninjured somehow. And then we got the terrible idea to trap a dragon inside Whiterun to make it tell us where Elduin was hiding. And I told the idea to the Jarl of Whiterun, who obviously said no, so we just begged him. And he finally submitted and just put his whole goddamn city in our hands. But firstly, we had to create peace in the ongoing war by inviting the Jarls of the two sides, Stormcloaks and the Imperials, to a meeting with the Greybeards. As usual, the meeting took way too long, but when it was done and peace was settled, we called upon a dragon in Whiterun and made it fly right through a building and a little after that, we put a giant log around its neck. It apparently liked the log neck thing because it offered to fly me to Elduin's hiding spot just like two minutes later. Well, not technically to his hiding spot, we had to pass through a whole dungeon first. Also dragons, of course. Which I can't really kill. And this guy. Put him out of the edge. Goodbye. Get me in here. See, this is not a very good uh, situation for me here. This is not exactly ideal. You can see. So, I forgot to take all my things back from Riverwood when doing that uh, little quest there. So we are we don't have any gold, we don't have any healing potions. Just uh, generally very good things. No. It's doing great actually. Better. Come on. There we are. 
on. This little piece of shit. Little scissors here. How strong are these? 16. I don't know. It seems good. But oh, they're really fast. Oh my god. Oh yes. They don't do the most damage in the world. But they do damage real fast. Okay, okay, okay. Chill out, chill out, chill out, chill out. Give me a break, please. What? No. No. There we are. Nice. <laughs> so fast. <laughs> My God, it hit so fast. Watch this. Crushed him. But first of all, we check this little power here, and we do like this. Oh fuck! It already broke. Fuck. Man, the order broke. That's horrible. Give me this. There's nothing. What do I do? Give me this then. It's fine. There we are. Does quite a f quite a bit of damage for a one-handed weapon, but it does also break in one. Oh, there's an area right there. All right, get one of these. There we are. Get this. Yeah, ready. I, uh, are you ready, Drug Overlord, to be absolutely m destroyed? Are, are you ready? Are you sure? Are you ready? Alright. <laughs> so funny. And then defeat an extremely strong flying dude. He's just standing there. Let's go get a free hit on him. No. I don't want to, I don't want to see that. No, get out of here. Ah, you stupid ass. <laughs> Dragon doing there! Alright. Oh, we should be good. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, holy shit. Jesus Christ. Well, what just happened to my health? What the hell? Alright. This for a second. <laughs> what? What just happened? Come on, come on now. Jesus Christ. Oh my god, we got him. All right, all right, all right. This is much better than my than my cool helmet. I still want to use my cool helmet though. And then we could enter the realm of Sovngarde. Inside the realm of the old Nordic warrior souls, we found the Hall of Valor. Protected by a huge man who wanted to beat us up. So we defeated him and inside the hall we found the warriors who was gonna help us defeat Alduin once and for all. Sadly though, we couldn't find a hot tub to kill Alduin with, so we had to stick with a candlestick. And then after clearing Alduin's weird mist, he appeared from behind a mountain. Come down here, Alduin. Just chill out for a second. Chill out for a second. I got him. Get down here. Fuck you, man. Okay, okay, okay. Chill out. I'm the one who actually can die here, so I shouldn't take all the hits. Get him!
be destroying him right here. Oh my god. Are you guys ready? Are you ready for the for the end of Elduin? Be together with the candlestick. Oh my god, not me. No, 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 no. Oh, give me a break. Give me a break. Yeah! <laughs> we got him! Let's go! Fucking loser. Imagine getting beaten to death with a candlestick. What a beautiful sight. There we are. Nice. Nice. Let's go. And there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. After smashing chairs on drugs' heads, beating people with a candle, and crushing things with a barrel, we completed the challenge. So if you managed to enjoy it, leave a like, subscribe, and become a member to help out my channel. Also, remember to join my Discord channel via the link in the description. But that answers the question. Can you beat Skyrim? with junk as weapons.